When it comes to building resilient networks, this notion of stacking is what many people hold up as the way to do it cost effectively and scale with your network needs. But stacking is also a highly misunderstood term. So getting to the bottom of this is very important. And today, Jimmy Ray Purser caught up with Jose Martel to get answers to the questions that you have. Stacking, just stacking? Actually, no, you know, stacking is just a buzzword that has been used by a lot of competitors. A lot of customers see value in stacking and say, well, stackable switches, I want it, right? But not all stackables are the same, right? Stacking means more than just piling switches, you know, next to each other, daisy chain. It's more than that, it's operations, automation that goes behind those switches. There's a protocol that activates everything that a customer needs, like ease of operation, ease of adding switches, copying configuration, uh, doing upgrades and checking if all the switches in the uh, stack have the same version of iOS. Well now, so, so one of the things that I see a lot of uh, competitor stacks do is that they're actually taking just a standard ethernet cable and they're, and they're plugging it straight in here um, and, 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 and they're like, okay, this is our stacking, port one to port 24 and it's stacked. That's not the case here. We're actually talking about a separate plane Exactly. to stack and cluster these together. Well, let's, let's kind of jump into to, to clustering. Is there a difference between stacking and clustering? There's a big difference, right? Clustering is just a manner of uh, 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 aggregating switches via uh, management only. Just management is, is being um, uh, consolidated per se, right? Stacking, so stackable switches, what they do is they have specialized connectors in the back of the switch, a high speed, right, that allow the switches to integrate one with each other. Now, with stacking, switches become one. Not virtually, but physically they become one bigger switch. And you add switches, up to nine switches, as many as you need. Okay, now see, so what, now, now what I also hear a lot of folks say uh, competitively, when they're talking to me and I'm out on a sales call and they're saying, hey, I don't like the stacking in the back because then if I have a, a, if I have a multicast, then it's felt all the way up and down that stack. And is, is that the case? Because I'm like, I don't think that's true. Well, this is what it is, right? What's happening is when you have a stack of switches, right, a packet, that is destined to a, um, a group of listeners, right, of a multicast stream, the packet has to go through the entire ring. Bir behind the switches there's a ring, and a single packet goes all the way because there may be listeners on this port, right, that may be interested in that stream. When, we, when you look at competitors, what happens is that, what they do is that from each switch, they send a packet for each of the switches in the stack, which multiplies the amount of packets that go in the back taking a lot of, uh, uh, wasting a lot of uh, bandwidth. Absolutely, that, that's, a, that's a big thing that, that I think that, that our stacking solution has over others mm -hmm. um, as well. But also I think a real important thing to remember here too is, is that when we're setting up our, our top of stack switch uh, in this environment, we're, we're actually able to not only, to, to really unify, because you mentioned earlier about these are all a single physical switch, but I don't think that, 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 that explains it as deep as we need to go because a lot of other folks out there are saying, well, we got this top of stack switch and you can manage it with one IP address. We're not really talking about, a, about necessarily one IP address to access all these switches. We're talking about tying together firmware, configurations, uh, have some failover res redundancy or resiliency. Exactly, you're right about that. See, clustering means is, is, is about just connecting switches for the purpose of manage, managing, managing those switches with one IP address. But what stacking does is make the switches one, right? Which allow us to use features across the switches. Let's say I would want to use a port from this switch and a port from this other switch and make them a bundle, right? Make an ether channel. I could do that across the stack. That would uh, increase the high availability on my switch, on my stack for that matter, right? Absolutely, absolutely. So I think that's a, that's a real advantage um, to the, the, the stacking, uh, stacking clustering uh, type of model is the ability to, to push out the, the, the entire feature set to keep our configurations consistent um, and also uh, our log consolidation for, for troubleshooting and things like that are so much more easier when we kind of cluster and stack these together. Would you agree or no? I do agree, but um, I don't like the word clustering. It's stacking, truly. Uh, what we do here is stacking, right? What we're doing is sharing the features across the entire switches, the, all the switches in the stack, right? What it is that the features are spread across the switches as if it was one simple single switch. Whether it is Ether channel, whether it is QoS, right? It's all across one single switch. You see, you know, that, that's, that's interesting that you mentioned that, Jose, because I kind of like the word clustering. I'll tell you why. Because so many competitors say stacking. Yeah. You know, and it's like, I don't, I don't want to really compare, put the two in here and saying that, you know, that, that, that my bicycle, because it has wheels, is the same as a Ferrari because it has wheels. You know, so I, I tend to, to kind of drift towards the other one, but you think stacking's a more appropriate, and I agree, it, it is a little more appropriate term, but man, I like to set it aside and say, look, you're getting a little bit better technology here, and you need to look a little bit deeper at what we're actually doing uh, physically, 
to these switches here to, to make them truly a, a one consolidated unit. It's not just an IP address. We're talking about pushing out all these features, keeping our firmware consistent, do our security, our logging, blah, 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 blah. Correct. So yeah, again, stack, uh, clustering is just management. Stacking is management and control and data plane, right? All through the stack-wise connectors perfect. in the back. That makes perfect sense, okay. Yeah. Well, Jose, thanks a lot for your time, man. I no. really do appreciate it. Thank you.